So now we will be doing the next part trace our activity in the module 3, which is the investigate our villain implementation. Okay, we're already done with this part. Where is the broadcast? So just assimilating the network who can receive the broadcast message in a villain. Okay. Wow. So we also don't have So this activity also does not have the completion score. So here the addressing table. So this is quite complex looking. So we have here PC is two PC nine. PC nine. So each PC have uh, each switch have three hosts and each switch we have three hosts. So for the objectives of this path tracer, so we have to observe broadcast traffic in VLAN implementation, observe broadcast traffic without VLANs. Okay. In this activity, you will observe how broadcast traffic is forwarded by the switch. When VLANs are configured and VLANs are not configured. So for the part one is observe broadcast traffic and VLAN implementation. So also, so this part will also need the simulation time. So ping one from ping one to PC six. So with all the link lights to green, so all the link lights are green now. To accelerate this process, click fast forward on Click the same result and add simple PDU tool. Click PC1 and then click PC6. So, I have here the PC, simple PDU, PC1 and PC6. Okay. Okay. Click the top turn forward button. So, observe the ARB request as they traverse the network. So, when the proper Full windows appears for the previous events. Okay. The pin success was a pin. Look at the same way. Where did S3 send the packet? Okay. This one. Okay. VLAN 10. Oh, okay. Because it's also in the VLAN 10. So it also uh, send. So the switch also send the frame on the VLANs uh, 10. Also VLAN 10. Now it should be PC6. Wait. PC1. I 
click PC1 and PC6 so you just need to delete this then add PC1 and PC6 ok so this is the PC6 Normal of operation where a switch receives a broadcast frame, one of its port former supreme out of all other ports. Notice that S2 only sends the app request out of uh, fuzzy internet. This is S1, so this S3 only sends the app request out of F11. PC4 PC1, PC4 both belong to VLAN 10 so PC6 belong to VLAN 30 because broadcast traffic is contained within the VLAN so PC6 never receives the app request from PC1 so because PC4 is not the destination it discards the app request so the ping from PC1 fails because PC1 never receives an app reply okay so if you do not about security also she only sends uh, the frame where the VLAN will ping from PC1 to PC4 PC7 so we already did that PC1 to PC4 So it also sent in this PC because it also belongs to the VLAN 10. Wait, is it successful? There's no check. Absorb uh, broadcast traffic without VLAN. So clear the configuration on all three switches and delete the VLAN database. Just delete. Ibilan mo diyan. So the top one is clear. Okay. So return to real time mode. And then delete the start of configuration on all three switches. Delete the VLAN file and all So, VLAN file is turned. Delete the start. Start up. Reload ba? Let's search it. To verify. So, what command is used to delete the start of configuration? I think it's reload. Erase command. Oh. Let's see. config author so if your Cisco which runs the cat OS so if your switch runs Cisco IOS and this runs so both of you which you need to clear so log into the switch sorry 
Deleting. Investigate a villain interpretation. How can you delete that? Finding four answers. To delete villains. No villain. Can we delete it? Start up configuration. We'll be doing this. We just need to. What? Enable. Right there is. No villain, villain ID. Okay. Where is it? Global configuration. So I'm fifty. No villain. Load. 
Just switch all the links. Oh. The normal link lights. <laughs> so from the scenario zero. Can improve network performance. So far, just traffic is completely good. up billion ten billion six for example uh, so we configured it from this is this uh, so we just need to repeat this one Ah, good then erase eh? how to erase I think I just need to run again Delete the startup configuration on all three switches. I think we just need to reload it. Enable. No villain. No villain. No villain. No villain. So, delete the VLAN file on all three switches. The VLAN file. Okay, okay. Sino ba ganun ang hanoon? Ang tablet? So, delete VLAN file. Delete flash that. 
just need to delete this one. Ate! Ate na saan kaya ang pag-lit? Hindi ko alam. Ate na ba? Hindi, hindi ako may pag-lit. Hindi mo na ito ako na magtay na. Okay, for the third time. Just need to... I just need to delete the file here. Delete file name, yes. Film away. Enable. Just need to erase the start up. Send out. Okay. Let's reload it. Reload. Last one. Delete the startup configuration and all your settings. Now we delete. After we delete, then okay. Okay. Enable. Right arrays. Yes. file in all switches. Delete VLAN dot dot. Yes, sir. Yes. And 
this doesn't work, we're done. Load the switches. Okay, we load command. Load. Okay, that's it. Now we'll be sending a PDU message from PC1 and PC2. Pa! To PC1. Yes, that's what I like. Okay. PC1 and VLAN 10 sends a broadcast message. Otherwise, it receives. That's it. 